This video is about hypothesis testing. A dry cleaning store is open six days per week and closed on Sunday. The manager of the store forms a model to forecast the number of customers visiting the store so that he can effectively roster the staff. According to his model, customers visiting the store are supposed to be evenly distributed across the six operating days of the week. To ensure his model is accurate, the manager records the number of customers visiting the store each day in a particular week. The results of this sample are shown in the table below. The manager conducts a chi-square goodness of a fit test at a 5% significance level to test the accuracy of his model. Whenever you see 5% significance level, means p-value less than 0 0.05, reject HO, no hypothesis. The manager conducts a chi-square goodness of a fit test at a 5% significance level to test the accuracy of his model. So for no hypothesis, his model is accurate. Alternative hypothesis, his model is not accurate. According to his model, customers visiting the store are supposed to be evenly distributed. We need to add all this together. Then divided by six, we can figure out uh, how many people visiting the store each operating day. We add all this uh, number together, we got 804 customers all together. 804 divided by 6 equals 134. So we get 134 for each day. Therefore, for B, determine the expected number of customers visiting the store each operating day according to the model 134. Let's go to C. Write down the number of degrees of freedom for this test. N minus 1 is the degree of freedom. N is the number of data. All together we have six data. 6 minus 1 is 5. Write down the p-value for this test. Let's go to chi-square GOF test first so that we get some clue where we will put the data. Stat tests chi-square GOF test. We need to put original data in L1 expected in L2. Degree of freedom is 5. Then we can put a calculate after we put our data in L1, L2. I just put the data into L1, L2. L1 is original data. L2 is expected data. Then go back to stat, tests, go to chi-square GOF test. Our degree of freedom is a 5. We got p-value equals 0 0.151. For C2, p-value equal 0 0.151. C3, write down the conclusion to the test. 
justifying your answer. 0 0.151 greater than 0 0.05, which means uh, we don't have enough evidence uh, to reject HO. His model is accurate.